Welcome back to AI Mind Blowing, the channel where we explore the fascinating world of artificial intelligence. Today, we have an intriguing topic to discuss, the AI black market. Yes, you heard it right. Artificial intelligence has found its way into the underground world, and it's time to uncover the secrets behind it. The AI black market refers to the illicit trade and use of artificial intelligence technologies for malicious purposes. It's a shadowy realm where AI is exploited for hacking, cybercrime, and even weaponization. Let's dive deeper into this dark side of AI. What is the dark web? The dark web is a hidden network of websites that exist on an encrypted network and can only be accessed using specialized software, such as the Tor browser. The anonymity provided by the dark web makes it a popular platform for illegal activities, such as the buying and selling of illegal drugs, weapons, and stolen personal information gained by identity theft on black market websites. The dark web operates differently from the regular world wide web that we use every day, as it is not indexed by search engines and is not accessible through traditional browsers. This means that users must have a specific set of technical skills and knowledge to be able to access and navigate the dark web. While the dark web is often associated with illegal activity, if it is also used for legitimate purposes, such as for whistleblowers to communicate with journalists securely or for political activists to communicate in countries where free speech is restricted, it is important to note that the dark web is not a safe place and can be a dangerous environment for those who need to become more familiar with the technology and risks involved. The anonymity provided by the dark web can also attract criminals and hackers who are looking to exploit unsuspecting individuals. The Digital Black Market's Mechanics Malware Development to Compromise Consumers' Internet Security There is a company behind every virus, worm, bot, and other malware. Heads of criminal networks communicate with programmers to create malware, hackers to breach into networks, or other scammers and fraudsters to create spam and phishing assaults. The victims are often Windows users and online users who have been duped while searching for particular information, banking, or networking. If you fall victim to one of their internet security hoaxes, your information may be kept on servers that hackers may access. They may use it to get into your accounts and engage with identity theft to steal your money, or they can sell it on the internet black market. Involve the promotion of illicit internet goods. The internet black market, like legitimate commodities markets, is very competitive. To be lucrative, cyber criminals must advertise their goods to other criminals. They create promos, demonstrations, service guarantees, and even discounts for big purchases, all of which are promoted on underground forums and, sometimes, social networks. This proves how identity fraud methods have become sophisticated recently. The Sales Procedure A cyber crook becomes intrigued by the offer of another cyber crook. What is the sales process like? Negotiate with the client slash vendor through private chat or email using generic addresses. To distribute the goods, use existing underground internet shops. Determine the mode of payment, which should always be one that everyone utilizes, such as Western Union. If the product isn't functioning, contact customer service. For example, if a credit card number isn't valid, they'll replace it with one that is. Money laundering. This stage relates to cyber criminals who steal money from customers' bank accounts via bank transfers after they breach identity verification processes. As you would expect, this is dirty money that must be cleaned before it can be utilized on legitimate markets. This is when additional victims join the picture, money mules lured in by cyber crooks through bogus employment promises. They are offered large rewards just for collecting stolen funds in their bank accounts and then transferring them to overseas accounts, cyber crooks accounts. 
These victims' online security, as well as their physical security, is jeopardized. The AI black market is a growing concern in the digital age. Criminals are leveraging AI algorithms to develop sophisticated hacking tools, deep fake technology, and even autonomous malware. These advancements pose significant threats to cybersecurity and privacy. The AI black market operates in secrecy, making it challenging for authorities to track down and dismantle these illegal operations. From stolen AI models to AI-powered botnets, the underground market is constantly evolving. Law Enforcement Law enforcement agencies are working tirelessly to combat the AI black market. We are collaborating with AI researchers, cybersecurity experts, and international organizations to develop strategies to detect and prevent AI-related crimes. While the AI black market poses significant risks, it's important to remember that artificial intelligence itself is a powerful tool for good. It has the potential to revolutionize industries, improve healthcare, and enhance our daily lives. What next for dark AI tools? Because some large language models, LLM, are open source, anyone with enough knowledge can train them to create specifically tailored AI for fraudsters and cyber criminals, as was the case with GPTJ and WormGPT. Closed access models are not safe either, as someone could gain access to them and start reselling it to other cyber delinquents, as was the case with Canadian Kingpin 12. Moreover, as has been previously mentioned in this post, the hype surrounding AI tools has also attracted many scammers who have set up websites and telegram channels to deceive people into purchasing non-existent access to those tools. The rise in these scams is even more indicative of these emergent crime-enabling AI's popularity and interest from the underground community. As confirmed by last on their farewell letter, Anyone could reproduce what WormGPT did, so a likely new real business where scammers, developers, sellers, and buyers should coexist could be glimpsed. At the end of the day, WormGPT is nothing more than an unrestricted chat GPT. Anyone on the internet can employ a well-known jailbreak technique and achieve the same, if not better, results by using jailbroken versions of chat GPT. In fact, being aware that we utilize GPT-J6B as the language model, anyone can utilize the same uncensored model and achieve similar outcomes to those of WormGPT. We have seen the swift rise and fall of these AI tools with enormous potential in the wrong hands. These tools have demonstrated remarkable profitability, so they are likely not the last of their kind, as we already saw users trying to buy the WormGPT project moments after last published the closure of the project. That's all for today's episode of AI Mind Blowing. We hope this glimpse into the AI black market has shed light on the darker side of this technology. Remember, knowledge is power, and by staying informed, we can work together to ensure that AI is used responsibly and ethically. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on all things AI. Until next time.